it's Crystal the Nomad Nurse coming to you from Amtrak. I am about to review breakfast. So our friendly porter attendant brought breakfast and I ordered the railroad French toast. I had a choice of continental breakfast, which was a selection of a breakfast sandwich, blueberry muffin, Greek yogurt, assorted cold cereals and oatmeal. I had a choice of the railroad French toast, which is thick cut Texas toast served with apple wood smoked bacon. And I had a choice of a three egg omelet with Swiss cheese cheddar and mozzarella cheese is served with Red Bliss breakfast potatoes and chicken sausage. So I selected the railroad French toast and this is how and I ordered a ginger ale on the side um, last night I had a little accident I fell asleep and rolled over on my cup of ice that had melted and wet the entire bed I had to flip my mattress but so breakfast comes uh, came with the ice and the ginger ale even though I said I don't like uh, I'm not a fan of Seagram's ginger ale. Uh, let me give you a view of uh, how we're passing. I think this is a beautiful view. I love water. Uh, I decided to do that instead of ginger ale. So uh, it comes with smucker syrup. Actually get two. And I like that because I should have saved my butter from yesterday but I trashed it from dinner actually I gave it to the porter um, so you get two syrups and I like that because for me I'm one of those people who when I eat when I eat French toast and waffles and pancakes I feel like that one little syrup is not enough because it the 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 pancake or the waffle acts like a sponge okay so let's dig in so it comes in a foil to keep it nicely heated and warm so we have one two Two pieces of bacon and one, two, three, four pieces of French toast. And it d doesn't look bad at all. Okay, so the bacon is not necessarily crisp, but it's not crisp, but it smells good. I can't really smell the French toast. I'm going to put some butter on my French toast. Mom used to make French toast with cinnamon. Let's put a little, let's put a little butter on this and see what we're working with. Now y'all bear with me because I don't have a camera holder. I can tell you that the food is like lukewarm because this butter isn't necessarily melting quickly on it, but I'm gonna make it do what it do. Put a little butter on that. Now let's put a little bit of syrup, our Smucker's breakfast syrup. Okay. 
Okay. I'm sure they have a, uh, for diabetics, I'm sure they probably have a light syrup option. I did not ask. Um, I should ask. Uh, but anyway, sometimes the it's better to have the regular option than the sugar-free because uh, all those artificial flavorings. But even this is... Uh, this has artificial, um, the ingredients on it are not even, we already noticed that this is not maple syrup from Canada. So it's corn syrup, fructose syrup, water, salt. Why do we need salt in something that's supposed to be sweet? Natural and artificial flavors, caramel color. So this is not anywhere near maple syrup. It doesn't even mention maple flavor, actually it just says breakfast syrup. So I guess I guess you could put whatever you want. So let me try to figure out a way to prop you guys up while I try this French toast. So there's the French toast. It's a little um, dry. I'm gonna put some more butter on it. Let's see if that helps, cause it's not. I don't think I'm gonna finish it. I think I might end up eating chips for breakfast, but let's try this again. hard to get down. I've had worse. Alright, let's try the bacon. The bacon is not crisp, but it, it actually looks like grilled bacon. This bacon is not bad. They say it's apple with smoked bacon. And I would agree. Now, if they just would have ordered, if they just would have had an option just with toast and bacon, I would have taken that, but... The French toast just is not. I'm hungry. But I don't know that the French toast is worth the calories. I think I'm just going to eat the bacon. That's my second piece of bacon. I'm just going to eat the bacon. and not eat the French toast because it's just not worth the calories. I mean, it looks good. It 
just doesn't have any flavor. You can see how it's dry on the inside. No taste of cinnamon. I mean, I'm sure it wasn't made with love. So that's my review of breakfast on Amtrak. Uh, I would say the bacon saved it. The French toast is not horrible, but it's just, it's not, doesn't have a good flavor. I wouldn't, um, I'm not gonna waste the calories and eat this. I'll just eat my bacon and I'll drink my ginger ale and I will wait until I have lunch. Um, and I will be uh, getting some good old fashioned barbecue. So please like and subscribe my videos. I'm trying to grow my channel. Um, any suggestions, please put in the comments. If you've traveled Amtrak, what was your experience? I appreciate you. Life is what you make it, so make the most out of life. Hit that like button and subscribe and please share my videos. Bye bye.